how do you import? You can import a multitude of ways. The first way you can import is by going to File, Import Media. That takes approximately two clicks. If you don't want to click the mouse, you can just push Command I, and that'll pop up um, the Import Media window as well. And then you can click your Mad Mapper tutorial files like that. Or you can launch Finder, get to your desktop, and then locate them that way and just drag and drop. Let's grab um, Tutorial Space and let's bring Tutorial Space into our stage. Okay, so now once we have this in, uh, we will um, push the quad and that is going to highlight all of this and what we're gonna do is we're going to lock this image we're gonna lock it okay and then what we're going to do is we're going to import another we're going to import another file let's import tutorial loop one and I'm just gonna click and drag and now you have this neat little video here and you can see that on the side here you have play and mode and so we can pause this by pushing the pause button we can actually reverse the video by clicking the back arrow and then we can go to the first frame by clicking this icon and then if it's paused we can just go frame by frame backward or forward with these guys so the mode once we play it right here this is the loop icon if it if that is highlighted then it'll just continuously loop this um, this video I believe is 30 seconds long so once 30 seconds is up it'll loop again but if you want it to stop at 30 seconds then you will click this linear button and right now it's at 27 28 and it'll stop right now so it'll just stop um, so if you have one video that you want to go all the way through and not stop then that's what you're going to want to do this one we want to loop and we want it to go forward so okay so now this is when we're going to play so now we have this locked layer that we have locked which is a virtual space that we have created and so this is going to mimic basically um, us taking an image from the actual projector so let's say that the lens of the projector is right here and that we took this picture with the camera where the lens was right here this would mean that right now i am setting up how i want to lay out this space with the projection so now let's add another quad and let's say that we want to we want to grab these uh, we want to grab the center of the mountain and so we just want th this portion of the video so we're going to scale it down to this portion and then we are going to come over here and we are going to project it against this wall so also i did forget to mention up here there is a magnet icon and this magnet icon if it's deselected it will not snap if it is selected it will snap to the corners so it doesn't snap to the corner when I'm trying to play with it and then we're gonna wanna put it against the wall like that 